I know he realized if you let inerrancy slip, then you've let every single doctrine in the scriptures slip intellectually. And I think Norm has that burning passion. We've got to keep doctrine pure. And if you don't stay onto the issue of inerrancy, it'll slip. It'll slip gradually without knowing it. That's why you always need someone like Norm to come back and bring you back to that spike in the ground with the chain to the elephant's foot that will keep pulling you back, pulling you back. And I don't think there's anyone out there that's done a better job on that over, I would say, the last 40, 45 years, 50 years than Dr. Geisler. So I think almost everybody out there that dealt with inerrancy, Norm, had had a profound impact in their lives. And you know, most people will go through life and they don't leave a legacy in people and organizations. They just leave their own personal. Norm has left a legacy in other people's lives, my life and many others, and has left a legacy in many organizations, seminaries and all. I think anyone who would read Norm's books an inerrancy or whatever, will walk away saying, it's not people's opinions, it's truth.